Okay, I think, yeah, here we go. Every time there's a new Logitech G-Hub update, I have to reconfigure my freaking mic. Here we go. So, uh, what were we planning on doing? All right, we were, um, last time we, uh, lost the Jabberwock. Our, uh, pricey flagship. But, oh, well. Who cares? So, what do we have here? Diplomatic legations, I like that. Let's see over here. We are at war with Nem. Is that also the state over here? It's the same state, okay. So, with our allies of Catbridge, we are taking over this little uh, continent here. And uh, once our fleet over here has been resupplied, I think we can send a spy over here. And see what they have. Oh, the game is lagging now. The game is really lagging now. Okay, here we go. Speed it up just a little bit. We also got loads of money. Is there a shipyard in here? Why can I not build over here? Oh, because I'm still doing takeover. Okay. Also, sky cracking. Mm, tempting. Now, view city. I only got one measly defense, so the millisecond we get ready to go over here, we will invade. In the meantime, what is uh, happening over here? Didn't we also have some little vessels over here? Yes, we do have one blobfish and also three tapirs over here. Um, We got lots of income right now, so how about... I think we can even afford to design a new flagship soon. Tell you what, once we've taken over this continent, like this small little Australia looking island, then we shall build a new flagship. In the meantime over here we will build a large shipyard and a logistics center. University. Maintenance costs, uh, research and reputation. I don't really need much research right now. Oh, incoming fleet. Where are they going? Uh, to UNESCO. Where is UNESCO? Oh, all the way back here? Okay. Uh, can't even make it over here. Uh, tell you what, how about we... Do we know how big this fleet is? No, we don't. Uh, design a lunch... Landship would be kind of stuck here, but I guess. No. Tell you what, uh, we will build a Needle Mark II. In the hopes of. Intercepting whatever is coming here. And that needs top priority. Which I can't do because I have to build a shipyard first. Arr! Oh well. We will just absolutely obliterate these mofos. Won't even need the needle. We we'll just go. We will just move right over here to a small little bombing run. If I even need to. Oh, the needle doesn't have a tip. <laughs> the needle doesn't have a needle. Or weapons, I think. Yeah, it doesn't even have weapons. Oh well. As soon as our Barracudas, oh, they are on fire. Hold up. Focus on firefighting. Because if that blows, it's gonna be real bad. OK, 
Okay, here come the bombs. Now we can focus back on shooting. And just go aim fire. No need to rush. Actually just go normal fire. Oh, what the? Okay, uh, you have no water, so let's just uh, ram you over here and commence the boarding. If they can even make it that far, shave some trees. Nope, that's one needle down. Oh well. Yeah, uh, just board. Quick jump out. Oh, it doesn't matter if we won. And we somehow kept the ship, okay. Gentle takeover, and now you... Uh, there's no freaking way. We're gonna make it in time. So they're going to take that city, most likely. Uh, what do we have here? Keep state, double fleet supply limit. Absolutely, I want that. Oh, and they're sending another one down here. Okay, okay. Oh, maybe, maybe we can just make it. Because the needles are quite... We need to supply first. Okay, intercept here. So that I can at least intercept over here. Yeah, we're gonna flee. Only got one ship, okay. Okay, just... I think we're going to go over here. As the needle is quite fast. And then ram them from behind. Or just, just board right now. If they can make it. They can make it. Oh, they just fell to the deaths. Oh, Lord. Uh. Ram. Nice. And now board, please. Nice. Easy enough. So we have gained them. Uh, now return there. Oh, they are helping us out. Nice. I think so. Are they helping us out? No, they are returning to Nem. Uh, you go over there as quickly as possible, and you. Uh, I guess we can design, build a tapir as they are quite cheap. I will even build two of them. And now they are invading over here, but I will most likely intercept. Yes. I will intercept over here. And they've blown off the assault, okay. Now let's just quickly build our two tapirs and then quickly take back the city. Cannons no longer explode would be kind of nice, but double bomb accuracy, yes, I do want that. For aerodynamics. Uh, now we can have rocket accuracy, no torpedo bombers. Guided missiles, maybe? Mech spiders? Mech spiders would be kind of cool. Uh, ship construction speed, I think I want that. Yes. Age of Piety. Minus 10% on rest in towns and cities. End the age in your favor by controlling all three holy sites. 25 base research, all of that. Fancy schmancy stuff. 
Okay, what are we gonna have here? Does that thing have a laser cannon on the front? I don't even know. Uh, yeah, you can just, just, I don't know, chill in the back over here. And you... So this is gonna be the most pathetic needle I've ever seen. Uh, our two tapirs can chill in the back. Can I give them commands right about now? No. Don't think I can. Uh, and the needle is going to capture that one. Oh, and I even got a two, my two barracudas. Nice. So they are just going to move as quickly as possible. Just do a bombing run over here. And you are going to ram this fella. And immediately board. Oh, they got suspendium cannons. Interesting. They're kind of like sniper rifles. And you go back here. And just shoot a little bit. You two do another bombing run over here. And we won. Easy enough. Gentle takeover. Uh, what's that? Oh, holy sites that I have to control. Yeah, that's... No way. Okay, so we have controlled this continent. And I think it's time to do some... Oh, they are fleeing. Okay. Mm. Is it time to declare war again on Superrock? They are weaker. They receive grievances from them. They are at peace with them. Okay. I think it's time to design a new flagship. I don't think I want a tier 4 cannon. Or do I? That thing is quite nice. Suspendium halberd. What's this? An Aspis cannon, I think? Yeah. So the Aspis cannon. A specific cannon was designed based on the hammerhead designs and enhanced target aerial foes from the ground. Okay. Suspendium railjack would be kind of cool. It needs pinpoint accuracy though. Tell you what, um, maybe missiles? Sounds like a huge ass missile ship. Or maybe... Uh, rockets? Backblaster rockets? Chimera rockets? Heavy bronze AP rockets that deal a fair amount of damage. Corsair rockets? Rocket launcher? I mean, having a rocket ship would be kind of cool. But I think what I want to do... Is get some aircraft in here. Biplane hook. Oh, that's cool. I think biplanes are uh, good anti-air. Now triplanes, flying units effective against lightly armored targets. Hmm. We're not exactly fighting any more lightly armored targets. Gatling skybolts? Maybe. Tell you what, we will do one, two, three, four, and five Gatling skybolts. And then biplane hook, maybe? Uh, from the below. So how about we do... A basic, get a corridor with ladder. Like so, and I do want one... Fire extinguisher there in the middle. Just like so. And then we can have... Um, some biplanes, maybe? One, two, three, and four. 
And then in the front, we can have like a weapon system. So let's do command and crew and get a command center in the front like so. And then we can have weapons on top and weapons below. So, multi-shot, mag cannon, shredder cannon. Allowed to design, uh, fire one powerful explosive clustered shell. Interesting, but I think I do want some rockets. How about we get some chimera rockets, one and two. And then also... Corsair rocket on the, the bottom? That would require a ladder, which I can put over here. Like so. And I just need a ammo store up front. Uh, resources, ammo store in here. Okay, that connects all of those, and then I can even put a fire point up here. Okay. Doesn't look too awful, I'd say. And then... It's in propulsion. And some lift, so how about we put a large suspendium chamber here and here and then also need some propulsion so a large propeller over here tell you what um i think i want like a big ass cannon over here so how about we take one more ammo store, put it over here, and then have like a tier 3 cannon, dorsal breach, no, heavy barrage cannon, heavy bronze cannon, oh no, that needs to be elevated way up here. Naval burst cannon, needs to be over here. Um, artillery, howitzer, not really. Mm. Doing the tier 3 cannon. So how about a breach cannon up here, maybe? A large cannon attached to an even larger dorsal mount. This cannon can puncture even the toughest of ships while still retaining a large fire arc. The size of the module and the cost of all the equipment is priced to compensate, however. I think I prefer some anti-aircraft, so uh, let me put all of that in the back a little bit. So how about we put some heavy SAMs? Oh, these, these don't require... These don't require a line to the front. Um, okay, so... Hammerhead cannon. So how about I put that up here? And then put some SAMs behind it. One, two, three, like so. And then that can all be kinda up here. Gonna be a long ship. So, and then we need some resources. Uh, definitely want a machine shop. Uh, I'm gonna say over here. No, actually down here. The ammo can go here, I guess. Like so. And we need coal. Put a coal store here and here. Two should be enough for two suspendium chambers. 
I don't want this thing to have a like a huge server ceiling, but just enough to keep us afloat. And then the machine shop can be here, and then I can even put some crew quarters. What do I need? I need supply hatches, uh, crew, and disconnected parts. Okay. So, quarters. I'm gonna put those in the back, I think, or maybe even here. Like so. It's a lot of crew. Okay, that should work. What's that? That's Corsair rockets. Um, I do want, if I can even have it, as a telescope in the front for some more accuracy. But crow's nest would also be nice. So I'll tell you what, I'll put that over here so I can fit a crow's nest here. And then all we need is just some more fire. I do need a sick bay and some repair stuff, so a sick bay can go here, I think. Yes. That does have a ladder, right? Only to the bottom? Anyway. Uh, it does not have a... Okay, then let me tell you. It can go here. How much capacity does it have? Uh, so you can restore crew members to full fighting shape again, whether they drag themselves here under their own power or are carried by a comrade. Up to three crew. I think that should work. And then we can put a fire point. I do have a machine shop, right? Yeah, I do have a machine shop. So I can put a fire point like so. Uh, reinforced supply hatches. All of these can now go here. No, they can't. Why can they not go? Like so? Mm. I do want... Uh... Some supply thingy magics. Uh, cargo bay. Because I want this thing to be on the road for a long ass time. On the road, on the sky. You catch my drift. Um, I need some more crew. So a berth can go here. Is an observation dome actually better than Crow's Nest? 10, 15. It is actually. Uh, but it doesn't really fit in here. I think a Crow's Nest is going to be good for now. And then I can even put just some corridors here. Maybe even another fire extinguisher. If I need to. Mm. Can I put anything here? I think I can. So how about we put all of that just a little bit back. Okay. Uh, but I can't put it down because of the huge ass cannon over here. But I can put all of that down, but I don't want to put it down, or do I? Hold on. If I put all of that just down over here, how is the coal supply going to be? Quite atrocious. Uh, yeah. Not a good idea. Uh, tell you what. I'll put one coal store over here. 
Yes, that should work. Hmm. Uh, this is a little bit of a pain. Uh, I want to put another repair station here or another... Hold on, another fire point can go here. If not, I'll just elevate the whole... Nah. Also doesn't work because of that freaking thing. Um... Does it need more propulsion? I don't think it does. First of all, armor. I think I'm gonna use it with uh, shell armor. For a little bit more lift. Or steel armor. Do want steel armor. Mm. Tell you what, how about we put a small suspendium chamber in here? Oh yes, it does boost the lift by quite a bit. And then tell you what, we'll elevate all of that just a little bit. That cannot go up unless I do that. And then I can just put more biplanes here. So we're going to have a full-on aircraft carrier. And that's also pretty much all I can afford. Um, put another quarters over here. And I'm guessing another sick bay. Am I missing something? Supply hatches, of course. Resources. I'm gonna put a steel cargo door in here. Still needs more supply hatches, okay. Then reinforce supply hatch here, here, and here. Actually, no. Corridor over here. And two over here. And that should be it. I don't wanna have a armor. I'm gonna have to save again just for a little bit of time. But I think that design uh, does not look good because there's just a crow's nest floating over here. There we go. Yes, structural integrity, I know. Um, and now, just needs to make it a little bit more angular. Just a little bit to the best of my ability, and I think that's it. Yes. Now, paint. Paint it all in steel gray. And I think I'm just going to run a purple stripe all the way over here. And I think that looks good for some decoration. Golden skull? Nah. Uh, where were the decals? Stencils. Here we go. Nameplate. Uh, cover up some of the hatches over here. And then flags. How about we put a tiny pennant over here and over here. And also one over here and over here. Yes, so that should be our nice aircraft carrier. Safe design. It is going to be the UDS Spear of Gunnir. 
foot wingy. Okay, leave. Ultimate despair life. 